What is going on, guys? It is Cryptic Gamerson, and I am playing. Today, I'm playing another. Um, I'm showing another gameplay of another legendary hero from Blood Heroes 2, which is an awesome app on the App Store. And today, I'm actually putting commentary to it. So yeah, so I'm just gonna basically showcase all his abilities and stuff. So alrighty, let's just find a target. Eh, uh, not you. Oh my goodness. This guy's a tank, though, guys. He does so much damage. Alright, uppercut. Here we go. It does basically a big attack, 111 damage there, and it knocks enemies back. Alright, next one is his throw ability. And this one recharges very fast. It's very handy. And it basically just throws them. And you can throw them right over the edge. So it is actually very uh, useful on a map like this. Because if you get some really big units on the map, you can just basically use that ability and throw them right off the edge of the kitchen. So this is probably the best map for it, I would say, by far, using the hamster. And I'm just going to make sure I have full health quick. And then I'm going to go show you his other two abilities. Now his passive, actually, I'll explain his passive in a sec. So let's use fear. Fear makes all those guys immobile for 3 seconds and makes me do 50% more damage to them. So that helps a lot. And look at that, I just knocked them all off the edge there. This guy's a beast. So his passive gives him more damage the longer he's in combat, basically. I think it's like 4 seconds or something of taking and receiving damage or whatever. And he gains like a damage buff from that. I mean, he's already pretty powerful, but damage buff helps a lot. Alright, so now let me show you Wrecking Ball. Wrecking Ball gives you plus speed, and it does automatic damage just by touching them. Not very much, but it sure helps because you're also invulnerable. So, like, I can just sit on this, uh, like, armored guy. That would normally be a pain to knock out and just do some pretty good damage like this. And I cannot take any damage. Did I get him? I don't even think I got him yet, though. He has... He has high health, so what I will do is I will pick him up, and I just throw him off the edge. Oh, dang, I hit the wrong guy. Oh, well, that's okay. So, yeah, guys, those are his abilities, so he's pretty awesome. So I'm going to bring him back over to the base. Watch he just knocks these guys right off the edge. So, yes, it's like Tarantula Scientist, where you can basically just throw him off throw like smaller units off the edge so yeah it's pretty awesome this guy must have the highest attack and I figured he would be pretty like one of the more popular legendary heroes so I decided to buy him and do a gameplay of him and I'm glad I did because I like him better than my other ones alright so here's his stats so I have not upgraded his uh, damage yet but look how much damage he has 76 base and he can get up to 106 now, he does not have any armor, so that is his weak spot. So, at best, he gets up to 60 uh, light armor and 3 heavy armor. So, he, uh, he does have high health, so, like, uh, his max health charm at level 6, I can get him to 928 health, which is pretty insane. So, yeah, guys, this has been the hamster. Now, if you like this video, please feel free to leave a like on it and subscribe. I'll have more of these coming out. Next, I'll be showing off my awesome crab spider um, strategy. So, yeah, uh, thanks for watching and adios.